Good morning, YPPC and New Age Pipe Smokers. It is Tuesday, April 5th. Currently 43 degrees. Overcast, going up to 55. Today I'm smoking my Costello stack billiard. It is um, C-Rock KK. This is uh, the pipe that I had uh, <clears throat> Ryan McCauley do his take on the real tall chimney stack, whatever you want to call it. <coughs> but um, I love this pipe. It's super light, narrow chamber, nice and tall. Absolutely perfect for Virginias and Vapors. Smoke this thing for a few hours. And in it today, I am smoking some HU Yeniman Flake. which is a fantastic Virginia Prairie blend. Crafted from, by Hans, which obviously if you know, if you know me, you know I love HU, and if you've had HU, you know how much of a mastermind Hans Wiedermann is. I mean, the guy's just otherworldly. I mean, head and shoulders above every other blender. It's not even a close second, to be quite honest with you. Um, I don't even know who I would put second, but I know Hans is top of the list. This was originally, I believe it was originally uh, concocted for a pipe club. Um, I, wanna, I don't know if it was in like Sweden or Denmark, not Denmark, maybe like Sweden, something like that. Yanaman Pipe Club, if I'm not mistaken. If, I, if my memory serves me correctly from the little research I did when I first got this blend almost a year ago, I guess. Uh, this is, a, again, another sweet vapor. Um, it's probably a little bit sweeter than Louisiana Broken Flake, being that Louisiana Broken Flake has more of a Perique funky sweet. Um, this has more of a, like a Salani 633 type of sweet, like almost like a sugar sweetness to the, to the Perique. Or the Virginias, I'm not sure what's impacting the most sweetness on it. I don't know if it's the Virginias that are used. Um, it comes in a, a beautiful flakes, almost like, uh, or like golden slice, like, you know, big, long strands of, of flake. I think it might even be one big strand, like, uh, like or like. But, um, it's really good. I mean, it's it's right up there. Louisiana Bro for HU blends is definitely <coughs> my probably my personal like my second favorite. Louisiana Broken and this they're both really really good. It's kind of like one and one A. I'm with you know putting it up there with the all the other vapors like London Flake, Escudo. Um, Solani 633, Louisiana Broken. Those are like my uh, my go-tos. Yeah, the 
stuff is just so good. I smoke it kind of sparingly. I think I only have a few tins of it. Uh, I already went through one tin. Um, I've gone through a tin of Louisiana Broken and a tin of Yanaman Flake since I um, originally got them. And they're 100 gram tins, and, and, and that was with me being conservative about smoking it. Because I, I could probably, if it wasn't for London Flake, I probably would have smoked it smoked multiple tins of it, but I've smoked God knows how much London Flake but uh that was good so I'm not gonna really talk you know, everybody with the that stupid cork sniffing comment um you know, people had some fun with it um, you know, and then there was this there's this dude, uh his name Wes maybe yeah Wes who was like going off tonight last night or this morning you know oh I thought I found you know uh, an adult pipe group you know and all I see is all these morons um, you know sticking corks in their nose which I'm pretty sure is directly aimed at one of our admins Ryan McCauley he was one of the first ones to make a funny post with two corks up his nose, smoking, a, you know, with a pipe in his mouth. And then the other people had, you know, had a little fun with it, you know, perfectly in, in fine and good taste. And this dude just, you know, oh, morons with corks in their nose. All I see is morons with corks in their nose. It's like, like, dude, this is probably, as far as pipe group goes, Naps is definitely the most loose, uh, fun-loving new age pipe smokers, you know what I mean, like, we break each other's balls, we make hilarious posts, we say outlandish shit, that's, that's what we do, it, that's what makes our group so great, you know, we're all inclusive, you know, and this dude's out there just, you know, talking shit on people, and then if you can't, you know, come back at him and say, look, dude, like, I'm just, uh, like, this, uh, this might not be the group for you, and he's like, oh, just, you know, carry on, stroll, you know, just, you know, it's like, dude, this dude ain't gonna last, I got news for you, because he's, he's, he's going after everybody, multiple admins, um, which is whatever, but, like, dude, like, don't, don't point your finger, and then when somebody points a finger back at you for the stuff that you're doing, which is way worse than posting some pictures with corks in their nose, uh, and then being dismissive and like, oh, well, you know, carry on. You can just like, you know, you don't have to like, you don't have to read my comment. It's like, you don't have to do the same thing, man. Be an adult. Pretty stupid. So, I don't know who this dude is. I'm assuming he's a relatively newer uh, member because he must not know how we operate. But, uh, yeah, come on, man. People are having fun. It just happened yesterday where that the dude made that stupid comment and then left the group. And people are, you know, just having fun with it on the same day that it happened. And he, you, you would think it's been like weeks of people, you know, s sticking quirks in their nose. Just, uh, dude, dude's just like a, a grumpy old codger that just wants to stir, stir up shit for no reason. And, uh, we're not gonna have it. We don't. We don't play those games. You know. If you're an asshole and you cause, you stir up shit or you offend people or all that stuff, you're out. This is not what. Uh, not what this group's about. You know, there's plenty of other adult pipe groups you can go and hang out with a bunch of stiffs that have no sense of humor that, you know, want to fall in line, but. You've come to the wrong group, my friend. But anyway, now that that's off my chest, I just had to had to address that because I don't like people that are just have a crappy attitude. Uh, but yeah, Yanaman Flake, if you can get your hands on some. Add this to the list if you're thinking about ordering from Esterbles to get uh, some of those HU tobaccos. Because like I said, they are well worth it. Well worth the wait. And 
if I can give you any advice, when I ordered from it, from there, I got, I loaded up on, on, uh, on Louisiana Broken, and then I got a lot of other blends, but not a whole lot of, like, amounts of them, well, I ended up getting a bunch of stuff, multiple tins of stuff that I didn't really care for, but if you're a Virginia, Virginia Paris guy, and you're ordering from there, you know, get Louisiana Broken, get Yanaman, get Old Fretters, um, I think you can, yeah, I think you, I don't know if you can order St. Bernard, I think that might be directly from Dan, um, but if you're going to order it, order like at least, you know, five tins of each if you're going to make that order, and you're going to make it worthwhile, this way, you don't find something you love, and then go, oh, crap, I should have ordered more, if you find, if you get stuff, and you, and you don't like it, and you don't want it, you can easily get rid of it, you can easily sell it, you know, and, and cover yourself. I mean, you can get more than what you paid for it because with the shipping and the fact that it's hard to get, um, you're not going to get hurt. So you can trade it for stuff that you do like. So it, like I said, if you're going to make an order, that's the one thing I would suggest. It's one thing I did is I, I wish I had ordered more of certain things. But... Stuff's so good, man. But anyway, um, that's all I really got for you today. So, uh, yeah. If you're, uh, if you're a member of the New Age Pipe Smokers, which I'm assuming you are, you know, or if you're a new member, I should say, like we have fun, you know, you know, that's, that's, that's what makes us so different compared to every other pipe group out there, you know, like this is a, a younger, more diverse, uh, group of, of people. And, uh, we say funny shit. We, we make crazy posts and like a lot of, you know, I mean, I don't really personally, I don't post a whole lot, but um, if you're easily offended, you probably shouldn't be in this group. If you don't have a sense of humor, you definitely shouldn't be in this group. Um, if you don't like running jokes or inside jokes, then again, probably not, not good for you. Um, so just keep that, keep that in mind, man. It's, it's, uh, we're here to have fun, you know, share knowledge and advice and our love for, for pipe smoking and we we really don't deal with any you know we don't deal with negativity you know if you're if you're bringing negative energy to the group if you're you know attacking people or talking shit on people or you know trying to belittle people you're going to be gone and that's not a threat it's just a promise it's something that that we feel very strongly about um it's not hard to be to be a good person and uh, not be a dick. So don't be a dick. With that being said, guys, that's all I really got for you today. Hope you guys are having a great day, a great week. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow on the, my main channel. And remember, the left lane is for passing. See you guys.